Hi Alex, my name is Neandra Conrad and here is a full website audit video for Briargate Advanced Family Dental. We're going to compare your website versus your main competitor. And there are three main things I wanted to cover here with you today. First is your Google business page. Second, your website content. And third are backlinks. So make sure to stay till the end of this video because I'm going to show you how you can potentially have 110 new clients every month and save around $20,000 in your marketing efforts. So the only thing I ask from you guys is some feedback. Please reply to this email and let me know if you found this helpful. And if you can also let me know if you're interested in knowing next steps for this opportunity, I'd, I'd appreciate it. So let's get to it. So when a customer is searching for a service, they usually Google it. So I went ahead and searched up dentists in Colorado Springs. And this section right here is what we call the Google Map Pack. And to the left of this map, map pack are Google Business Profiles or what we call GBP for short. So normally you can only see the first three businesses in this area, um, but this one right here is a sponsored ad. So Alliance Family Dentistry had to pay ads to be uh, placed on the very top of this map pack. We're not going to focus on that today because I don't want you to pay for any ads. We're going to talk solely about organic search. So you do want to be on the top three spots of these Google map pack because this is where most of the uh, traffic and leads go to. So I'm going to give you some tips on how you can optimize your GBP so that you can appear on these top three spots. So I actually tried looking for you guys and I found you on the 10th spot right here. So you guys are very close. So um, you can optimize your GBP by first adding at least 100 photos on your GBP. Right now you guys have 52, so keep adding those. It is a good way to show the quality of your work and the services you offer, so definitely add more. And the next thing I wanted to mention here are reviews. Um, continue to add reviews on a consistent basis. If you have um, reviews on Yelp or Facebook, import that on your GBP as well. That should help your organic search. The last thing I wanted to mention are citations. Basically, a citation is your business name, address, and phone number as it appears on your GBP and how many times it appears on the internet. So it is a popularity contest and you want to have more citations than your main competitor because this is a big credibility factor for, for Google and the more more citations you have that they can find that Google can find the more they're going to recommend your business to your customers so um, I hope that made sense so now that you know a little bit about how this area works the section below that is uh, where organic search rankings are applicable and that's uh, where your website content matters so let's take a look at your website so this is your website and I do love that you guys add personal photos of, of the doctor. It just makes it a lot more personal. So great job on that. The first critique I have for you guys is your website content. So the words on your website counts as website content and you do want to have 1500 to 2000 words of content because within that content, you're going to include as much buyer intent keywords. What's a buyer intent keyword? Basically, what people are searching for on Google when they're looking for your service. So an example of a buyer intent keyword is Dentist Colorado Springs. You can even be more specific to the services you offer and say uh, dental implants, um, Colorado Springs, right? Those are all buyer intent keywords that you want to add to your website. And that's going to make you rank for those search terms and be foundable on Google. So I hope that made sense. Next, I do want to show what's happening on the back end of your website by pulling up my web crawler program. And then we're going to compare your website versus your main competitor. So this is what's happening on the back end of your website. You guys are utilizing 168 of those buyer intent keywords we talked about. Let's take a look at your main competitor. So right now they're utilizing 523 keywords, right? And that's it's a huge difference. They're utilizing 523 keywords. Um, those buyer intent keywords we talked about that people are searching for on Google and you guys have 168. So definitely know what other keywords they're using and add that to your website as well. And that's going to make you more relevant to your services. The next number I want to talk about is this backlink number right here. Basically, a backlink is a link from a separate website that links back to your website. And it is also a popularity contest. You do want to have more backlinks than your main competitor because it is 
a also a uh, huge credibility factor in Google's eyes. The more backlinks you have, the more Google sees these websites vouching for your business. And that's kind of how it works. So right now, Springs Family Dental has 153 of these backlinks and you guys have 70. So they do have double the amount of backlinks that you have. And when you look at this, uh, Google sees 153 websites backing uh, Springs Family Dental versus they only see 70 websites backing Briargate Advanced Dental, right? And that's why Springs Family Dental is ranking first on Google. So now that you know a little bit about how this works, let's tie it all together. Let's just say you implement the things that you learned today and you start ranking higher on Google or um, higher uh, ranking first on Google, actually. Well, this is the amount of traffic that's coming into your website, around 2,000 people visiting on your website because that's what's happening to your top competitor. And of course, I understand not all visits will become clients. So let's just say 10% of that website traffic um, become inquiries and 200 people actually call you to ask, oh, how much does, uh, does it cost to get my teeth whitened, right? And of course, not all inquiries will become clients. So let's just say half of those inquiries become clients. That's a hundred new clients every month just from organic search. And that's potentially what's happening to Springs Family Dental because they are ranking first on Google by optimizing their keywords, their backlinks, their GBP. Um, they are they are um, getting all this traffic to their website and potentially a hundred new clients. And this number below that reads 21,000 right here. This actually shows you how much they're saving every month on marketing efforts just from ranking organically. So they're also saving an extra $21,000. And that's huge, right? That's a huge amount of money that you can reinvest in your business or invest in your training to expand your business. So um, just wanted to give you some value in today's video and hopefully you implement the things that you learned today. Um, this is what I do for a living and I enjoy it a lot because I value transparency with this whole process. I do want you guys to understand where you're putting your money in because I do see a lot of businesses pay so much for paid ads like Google ads and Yelp ads and it just breaks my heart to see their hard earned money go to waste. So I really hope this gave you value and um, in the beginning of this video, I did ask some feedback. So please respond to the email. Let me know if this was helpful and uh, please let me know if you're also interested in knowing next steps. I'd love to create a whole plan on how we can beat your competitor and bring you an extra 100 leads every month or 100 new clients every month. Again, my name is Yandra Conrad and thank you so much for watching this video.